Hi, I'm Lou and this is Cody and today we're going to show you how to make a doggy wheelchair. Here are the major parts we'll need. Two lawnmower wheels, a 3 8 inch by 1 foot long threaded rod, two nylon insert 3 8 inch lock nuts, a 5 foot section of 1 half inch CPVC piping, four elbows, four tees, CPVC cement, roll of duct tape, and a handsaw or a hacksaw to cut the tubing. All these parts should cost less than $25 at the hardware store. You'll probably want to buy two sets of connectors. They're really cheap and you'll probably make the first chair the wrong size. Actually you should use CPVC cement for CPVC piping, but it's orange and it kind of looks funny on the pipes, so I'm using PVC cement and it holds almost as well and it's clear. Start by cutting eight pieces of tubing five and a half inches long and two at one and a quarter inches long. These pipes stick together like tinker toys, but you just put a little bit of glue on this one and on the inside of this one, stick them together, twist a little bit and let it dry. Within 30 seconds it's done. If you want to make your chair look better and you don't mind spending a little bit more money, you can get this clear cleaner, you rub it on there, and you can wipe the lettering right off. Start with two T's and connect them with one piece of pipe like this. That is going to be eventually your axle. Now go forward with two more pieces here and here, and then two more T's facing inward like this. Put a pipe between them. Put your two little pieces here and here, followed by elbows turning up, and then two pieces going up, two elbows, and then lastly two pieces going forward. Now we need to make the seat. Put three pieces of duct tape across like this and wrap them around and three more this way in the same way. By the way, there's a style of duct tape for every dog. Now we make the top strap. Simply take another piece of duct tape, much longer, and wrap it all the way around on both sides. Put one more piece underneath to make sure you cover all the sticky so you don't get anything in the dog's fur. And now it's time to put on the wheels. You want to have the sticky out part of the wheel towards the inside and the more flat part towards the outside. Just put them on like this, like that, and then you take your lock nuts and screw them on each side. And tighten those down a little bit with a wrench. And there's your doggy wheelchair. He sits here and his head is right here and you'll have to use a piece of string to tie around this into the back of his collar so it follows him along. Try it on your dog and if it doesn't fit you can easily make another one because the elbows and piping are so cheap. If your dog is really small they sell wheels that are about half this size. If your dog is really big you might want to step up to the three quarter inch size piping. Thanks for watching and good luck making your doggy wheelchair. What do you mean you want your own YouTube channel?